Hey everybody, I'm Johnny Catanzano, IFBB Pro Bodybuilder and Certified Personal Trainer, and I'm gonna show you a great intermediate level workout for your chest and your biceps. If you've been training for a year or more, try this chest and biceps routine. It uses dumbbells and cables, but if you don't have cables, that's okay. You can use resistance bands, and it's going to work the muscles from different angles and positions that you probably have not tried before. The exercises in the workout are organized into pairs, marked A and B. Perform a set of A exercise, then you're gonna rest, then perform a set of the B exercise, rest again, and repeat until all the sets are complete for each move in that pair. Then go on to the next pair and do the same thing. You'll do three sets of 12 reps for each exercise. First up, exercise 1A is neutral grip dumbbell press. Here you're gonna take two dumbbells, lie back flat on the bench. Make sure to keep your elbows tucked to your sides. You're gonna bring the dumbbells all the way down to your chest, fully stretching your pecs, and then press all the way out, just about locking out at the elbows. The reason we wanna use the neutral grip here, meaning our palms facing each other through the whole range of motion, is to make sure that we keep our elbows nice and tucked to our rib cage, which is gonna provide a lot more leverage right there for your pecs. For exercise 1B, you're gonna do standing pulley curls. This is gonna hit the biceps from the shortened position. You're gonna do this by making sure your elbows are slightly in front of you. You're gonna curl the weight all the way up to fully shorten the bicep head. Then in a controlled manner, you're gonna lower that weight all the way back down till your biceps are fully lengthened. For exercise 2A, we're gonna perform the incline pulley press. If you don't have pulleys, that's okay. You can do resistance bands. You wanna set your bench height anywhere between about 45 and 60 degrees, and you generally want your bands or your pulleys set below your waist, pretty close to the ground. You're gonna press the weight all the way up, out over your upper chest, contracting your chest, and then you're in a controlled manner, you're gonna lower the weight all the way back down as you feel your chest stretch all the way back out. For exercise 2B, we're gonna be performing stretch curls. You can do these with pulleys or with bands. When you set the pulley or your band, you're gonna to wanna to be at or below knee height. This exercise is gonna hit your biceps from the lengthened position because keeping your elbows behind you is going to hit them fully stretched out and keep them contracted at the top. Make sure to control that weight all the way back down, fully stretching that bicep back out. Sometimes you don't feel focused and alert in the gym and your workout can suffer as a result. Alpha Brain contains research-backed ingredients that support mental focus and can help you think more clearly under stress. It's the ultimate way to get into the zone before you hit the gym. Use the coupon code GETONIT to get 10% off alphabrain at onit.com. Now let's get back to the video. For exercise 3A, we're gonna be performing incline flies. You can perform this exercise with pulleys or with bands. Make sure to set your bench height at about 45 to 60 degrees. You're gonna make sure to also set the pulleys or the bands at their at or below waist height. You're gonna abduct your arms all the way up to the middle, contracting your chest, making sure to squeeze and then control the weight on the way back down, allowing your elbows to slightly bend at the bottom at about a 45 to 60 degree angle. For exercise 3B, we're gonna be performing alternating cross body curls. I really like this exercise because it allows you to abduct your forearm, which means bring your forearm inside across your body. What that is gonna do is put more tension on the short head of your biceps, to allow you to create more of that peak. So with your thumbs facing forward, bring the dumbbell up and across your chest, fully shortening the bicep head. Then in a controlled manner, lower the weight back all the way down so it's right next to your waist. You're gonna perform these alternated or you can do one side at a time. Thanks for watching everybody. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel and see below for a link to this bicep and chest workout. Also, if you want to follow me on Instagram, check me out at at Johnny Elgato underscore IFBB Pro.